abysmal and stagnant. New at 5 o'clock. That's how an annual report released today describes the progress of recycling in Colorado. Caridio News Channel 13 Scott Harrison explains what's going wrong. Most Colorado communities don't have this, a recycling program that's easy to use, accessible, and even free of charge. And that's a major reason why the state ranks among the bottom 20 states for its recycling rate. That rate, according to the annual State of Recycling Report, is 15 percent. That's less than half the national average and behind the state's goal of 28 percent by the end of the year. There have been success stories in the metro Denver area, Fort Collins, and Durango. But in southern Colorado, the report only says cities like Colorado Springs and Pueblo need more recycling resources and more information about what they're doing. We do reach out to them every year, but we, we don't get um, data. Great news from Colorado Springs, though, this past year they, have for the first time, have hired a sustainability coordinator. So that makes me really hopeful that maybe in the next couple of years we will get some data. And there's possibly another change coming. Next year, recycling lobbyists will work with state lawmakers to enact a producer responsibility policy. It will require manufacturers to reduce unnecessary packaging that adds to the waste stream and, through a fee, expand recycling resources for all Colorado citizens. It's a model that has worked in other countries but has yet to take hold in the U.S. One of the panel of speakers on Monday was Pueblo's Public Works Director, who talked about the challenges that communities have in trying to make recycling work. We'll hear more about that coming up at 6. In Colorado Springs, Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.